the city of Antwerp, your gateway to all things Belgium. Explore with me, unscripted and discovered. Doesn't have the population of a London, Paris, or Berlin, but the city's location in Flanders, just off the river, has made it a major destination for travelers all over the world. Antwerp is one of the continent's most fashionable and trend-setting cities, but this cathedral, while not exactly modern, is a great place to begin exploring. Antwerp is a city where history, modern architecture, art, and culture come together. Being Europe's diamond capital and a destination for fashionistas, travelers can expect Antwerp to deliver a great shopping experience on streets like this one, known as the Mir. Off the Palace Mare, you've got the Chocolatier because they have chocolate massage cream. You can put it on somebody, you can eat it. You can literally lick it off. Think about that. They also have chocolate lipstick and one more way to eat chocolate you might not have heard of. It's not a monster or a Coca-Cola ladybug or one of these three divas, though all of them are impressive, but a pick-me-up you probably weren't expecting. Antwerp is a high energy town. Maybe this is how they get it by snorting chocolate. You ever think of that? I certainly didn't, but here goes, here goes nothing. Got to get this thing set up, give it a little dip. They say make sure you don't do too much. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> okay, that's a first, snorting chocolate in Antwerp. I think my eyes are starting to water. Woo! That'll wake you up. Fashionistas will find their paradise in Antwerp. Whether from boutique designer shops or more recognizable mainstays, any avid shopper is sure to leave Antwerp with an updated wardrobe. And if you're looking for a diamond to top it all off, well, you're sure to find one here. Antwerp has embraced contemporary art and architecture, but that love for the modern has blossomed from a history full of beautiful classic architecture, as well as artistic masterpieces. Art history in Antwerp is showcased best by this, the Rubens House, the one-time home of renowned Flemish Baroque painter, Peter Paul Rubens. If you want to step outside the central part of the city, you can come to the south area. There are several museums, as well as plenty of cafes to sit back, grab a bite, and enjoy a drink. As you can see, Antwerp could be your gateway to all things Belgium, but it was also a gateway in the other direction. That direction, the new world. More than two and a half million people came through this very port on their way to, you guessed it, Ellis Island. 